I was going to say that, you know, it's time for you to tell us what you have up your sleeve, but you have a sleeveless blouse but on, I, so <laughs> we're just going to say, so, you promised us something yes, old school. I did. All right, what, what, did. what do you have in store for us here? Well, have you heard of a Singapore sling? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. When I was, you know, bartending back in the 70s and stuff, yes, okay, so it was here's a popular a, drink. Here's a piece of trivia for okay. you. Okay. What? So you notice these fun little tiki glasses yeah, I like that I brought. These are all this is coming back. It is so I fun. Know, I know. So yeah, we're gonna make a classic tiki drink today. Mm -hmm. And here's a bit of trivia. Okay. Do you remember the gentleman that developed a lot of these famous tiki rum drinks? Uh, uh, yee, no, I can't, Mister Potato Head. No, Beachcomber. I can't. Beachcomber. Beachcomber. Okay. Yes. Uh, yeah, gosh, I right. don't get to stomp you very often, but no, I did no, today. Okay, you've got, what, what okay. about? We are doing three ounces of just some classic um, London dry gin. Well, Bombay is fairly classic when yeah. you think about that. And that, yeah. that was the about an ounce and a half jigger on this side. Yeah, so I'm making two other. drinks, so we're right. going to put so three uh, ounces, we're gonna put three of, ounces of, of that gin. for a couple of drinks. We're going to do an ounce and a half of cherry liqueur and uh -huh. this is my favorite it's yeah. luxardo cherry liqueur yeah we used to use just like cherry juice from the cherries you know, the maraschino cherries well but this, but this is, is this but is this official. is macadoodle yes. so we have well to it's also this is the way yeah. it's done yeah okay and then and then we're gonna do if i can get that little guy out of the way we're gonna do an ounce and a half of fresh lime juice okay that's always good yeah lots of you know the singapore sling was famous just for its great like citrusy kind of yeah it's a very refreshing drink it's yeah. something you would sit out on the veranda with absolutely. watching the waves roll in absolutely yes. on the beach yep, now yep, yep. there's a couple of different styles some do not put any pineapple juice in but well, let's go for the pineapple let's juice. go for the pineapple juice how much so pineapple juice we're gonna put like an ounce and a half of pineapple juice in there okay because i know you or i neither one like things really sweet yeah you're so right so then we're gonna put Couple of dashes of bitters. Angostino bitters. Angostino yeah, bitters. That's been around forever. Okay, now you, you add ice in, in the ice shaker. Ice in the shaker. Uh huh. And then. Are you going to strain I'm that out? You want me to get that? Strong enough, yeah. You're going to get know. that you lid have, off you for may me. Have hammered there we it go. Down. And then Ooh. we're just going to pour okay. these classic little drinks in there and have Perfect. tiki drinks. Okay, and then we'll. Here, 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 here. There's still summer left, so still time to make some. You just classic hammered this fun. thing on I there, did. didn't you? I did. You didn't know my strength, did you? I didn't. There's still time to make some classic summer drinks, so I thought tiki drinks would be. Now fun. you could you could garnish this with maybe a little cherry, a little orange. I you know, would do you like, like a little skewer with like a cherry and an orange and maybe a pineapple oh, wedge that'd be on good. there. Okay. Cheers. To your health. Now, why did this ever lose popularity? I know. And this I'm, is you know, excellent. I'm kind of, I'm kind of getting back into gin right now. Yeah. I kind of go in ebbs and flows, but this is just a great, refreshing well, summer cocktail. Gin is a standard for so many of those drinks, it you is. know, that they made. But, you it know, you, you've got, you've got this. One I hope you can make in the future is the Sazerac sling. There, that's a little more involved. It, it is, but it's it was a favorite of people's for and, so many years. And you know what's years. funny is um, most people think that um, tiki drinks are all rum. Yeah, no, they're not. And they're they're not all rum. <laughs> Got a great one. Well, you can you, rum. Nothing wrong with rum, but no. yeah, this is a gin based. Isn't that drink. fun? Mm hmm. Hmm. So okay, you made this terrific drink. What else? You, what else do you have going on at um, Macadoodles right now? We actually have an upcoming cocktail class. So I don't know if you knew that we did cocktail classes. I did not. Yes. So we do cocktail classes. So we pick a different theme each time, mm -hmm. and Lucas, our bartender, sets up everything that you need, and you actually make the drink along with him. So he'll give you instruction, and we started out with just some really basic. You know, yeah. how you make a basic Manhattan, those kind of things. But now um, he's kind of he's So kind you of can bring it to your own home. You can bring it to your this own home. This is good. When, when are these? Um, we've got one coming up within the next week or so. Go to our Facebook page, Macadoodles, Fine Wine, Beer, and Spirits, South Springfield, and look at all of our events. But that's, that's just a really that's, fun thing. That's, yeah. that's going to be fun. All right. Coming up. Have you heard of Minute to Win It? Well, we're going to try out one of their games and see who has what it takes. 
to win it in that minute. Stick around.